Mobility startup Damon Motors enters eMoto Arena with EV debut. Vancouver-based mobility startup Damon Motorcycles has entered the EV Arena with a preview of its first eMoto, the Hypersport Pro. The seed stage company had previously focused on creating digital safety technology, like its 360-degree radar detection system, to augment two wheelers made by other manufacturers. Damon has determined to create its own EV model designed to overcome common flaws it sees in existing motorcycle offerings. We are for the first time being black and white about the fact that we are a full-on producer and we have a motorcycle we're going to unveil at CES, Damon Motorcycle founder and CEO J. Jero told TechCrunch. That machine is the fully electric Damon Hypersport Pro. The news is a pre-announcement ahead of the full January debut, so Jero would not offer much in the way of core specs, such as price, range, charge time, and performance. He was clear the motorcycle is meant to be a direct competitor to the latest T-Motos released by Harley-Davidson and California-based Venture Zero Motorcycles, and to the gas motorcycle market overall. We've come at this and the motorcycle problem in a way that no other company has, Chiro explained. We're trying to change the industry by addressing the issues of safety and handling and comfort and the problems that have persisted with everyone in the industry, including all the E-Moto companies today. Damon's Hypersport Pro is designed around the company's co-pilot system, which uses sensors, radar and cameras to detect and track moving objects around the motorcycle, including blind spots, and alert riders to danger. Damon has also taken on the problem of one-size-fits-all in motorcycle design, integrating a system on its Hypersport Pro that allows for adjustable ergonomics. The startup's debut model will allow riders to electronically shift the motorcycle's windscreen, seat, foot pegs, and handlebars to accommodate for different positions and conditions, from more upright city riding to more aggressive high-speed runs. Damon Motorcycles is taking pre-orders for its Hypersport Pro and will skip dealers, opting to use a direct sales and service model similar to Tesla. The startup's Vancouver facility is equipped to build 500 motorcycles a year, according to Giro. The company recently brought on Derek Dorestian, the former CTO of eMoto startup Atla, as its COO. Full specs of the Hypersport Pro will come next month at CES, but Giro did offer a glimpse, saying it would be more competitive and more powerful than existing eMoto offerings. Harley Davidson released its first e-motorcycle, the $29,000 Live Wire, in 2019 and California F Startup Zero Motorcycles launched its $19,000 Senior Slash F both in bids to go take Emoto's mass market. Aside from the price gap, both have comparable charge time. For more on this story, visit the news article link.